Okay, guys, you're locked in with DJ Marks on the Clockwork Show, and we just had Samuel Medias with Can't Be the Only One. Um, and I'll say at the top of the show, I've got Lady T, my colleague from Affinity Extra, um, doing this show with me. And we're going to be going over our top five tracks each from 2020. So, Lady T, man, say, say hello to the people. Hi, guys. How you doing? How you doing? <laughs> you know, listen, we were saying this before the start, man. It's, it's just been so hard making choice for that top five, girl. Listen. So I was like, I was, I, I thought, okay, yeah, this, these are the ones. And then when I looked at something, I was like, oh no, but this song is over. Yeah. This, no, this is hard. Top five is hard. It's hard. It, it really is. I mean, I, I said to you, you know what? Let's not limit ourselves to like UK only. Cause I know you did your um, top 10 UK. So I thought, okay, to make it a bit different, let's not say UK only. Let's kind of go worldwide. And that just made it worse. It, it did make it, it worse. make it worse. Because like there were so many checks to choose from and like, Literally, like you, I'm, I, I thought myself, okay, I know I have top five. And then in preparation for the show, as I'm like, you know, just going about my usual day to day business, I'm listening to my playlist on Spotify. I'm like, oh, I've got to get this track in there. It's mad, isn't it? It is so, so mad because I was just like, and, and I think, you know what it is? It's a good problem to have. Even when I was doing my top UK gospel ones, it was a good problem because I was just like, oh my days, like, wh which ones? Like, what ones? And this one was even harder because you opened it and I'm like, ha. Hey, this I, I, yeah. I'm stuck. I it, really it's I'm absolutely stuck. bad, man. I mean, <laughs> I mean, to be fair, I'm gonna say this as well, is that even though I opened it up and I said we could choose tracks from anywhere, I still found and probably for the first time that most of my tracks on the list were still UK. So I'm surprised <laughs> that I didn't go more further out. Yes, me too. And you and you're gonna see in my in my top five how much uh UK kind of like stood out in this like I, I was very very surprised I was like right okay yeah. UK we've been doing this come on it, it's a good look do. it's a good mm -hmm. look because it means that UK are actually doing some business out here so and I'm, I'm one of those people I'm very like um I'm down on tracks they need to be really good in yep. terms for me to kind of think so if I'm pulling these ones out from the UK and like U US are having a struggle to get in then that's good it's so good, trust me. Like it's it's the I think it's the best feeling. Like yeah. it is the best feeling because then you know like like y'all, like these guys be churning out the music, there's some great stuff. There's like, yes, this is it's up there. It's definitely, definitely up there with the others for sure. That's good, man. Well, you know what? Let's let's get started and I'm gonna let you go first. So what's your first track? You know what? I'd, is yours in any particular order? You just pulled out your, your favorite five from 2020. I think I'll just pull out my favorite file. Although the first one I am going to say, I'll say is my top one because yeah, but the other ones are in no particular order. All, all right, well, give it to us, man. What's the first track? Okay, so the first track for me is uh, Snatcher featuring uh, Angelo and it's called Children of God. This is such a good tune in every way, shape or form. Like come down to the, to the lyrics. If you listen to the lyrics, um the when you see the video as well the video is fantastic and and i am featured in it and I'm, i didn't choose it because i, I it's not my number one <laughs> where it's not my number one because i'm in it but before that like way before it was released i was like nah this song is for me it's an absolute banger of the track production on it is great um arrangement everything just the just the sound ugh, everything about the song i just like and I cannot sit still and listen to the song. There's always got to be some kind of body movement for me for this. And Snatcher has come such a long way. Um, it was a hard year for him in 2019 and then, you know, going into 2020 because his wife passed away, but then like being able to still do music, produce this stuff. And he's just so out there as well. Like he's yeah, not your yeah. typical regular rapper. Like he's very out of the box and he's, he will try things like crazy things. And this is just absolutely fantastic. And what a great, um, uh, feature from Angelo as well who's also producer visual um, artist as well and he yeah Angelo is, is dope like he is that guy if you want a track listen if you're an artist all right and you want something a bit different go to Angelo for that and then on top of that get something visually done from him as well he's brilliant absolutely brilliant so introduce your track man all right guys so this is my number one uh, track uh, for 2020 it's snatcher featuring angelo it's children of god whoop, whoop. hey yo angelo you ready let's do this 
Children of God, yeah, yeah. Shout hallelujah, yeah. Shout hallelujah to the Lord. Oh, yeah. Say me, say, children of God, yeah, yeah. Shout hallelujah, yeah. Shout hallelujah to the Lord. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Hallelujah. 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 Hallelujah to the Lord. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. Hallelujah to the Lord. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh, they never draw with us. Off the chain, come hang with us. With the cookies, come ride with us. Come ride with us. Yeah, yeah. Say we on the shame, got pride in us. <laughs> Emmanuel, our God with us. The lion of Judah, come round with us. Come round with us. Yeah, yeah. On a quest for nothing but his glory. Yeah, yeah. Goodness and mercy be my everyday dose for the year brand new every morning. Yeah, yeah. Eyes on the prize, boys know they lose focus for your love. Be the brand, that's how you know it. Grace and power is how you show it. Load in his glory, don't you worry about the diamond on my thighs. Spirit be walking full time inside. Children of God, yeah, yeah. Shout hallelujah, yeah. Shout hallelujah to the Lord. Oh yeah, say me say children of God, yeah, yeah, oh yeah. Shout hallelujah, yeah. Shout hallelujah to the Lord. Oh yeah, yeah, yeah. Hallelujah, 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 hallelujah to the Lord. Oh yeah, yeah. Jesus Christ, on the same. Of the gospel that's able to save So I'm living my life for the world, yeah, yeah As my big brother did the same When he came, when he came, yeah, yeah And took all my sins away Giving his life on that righteous cross for me Even when I was deep in my sin, deep in my sin Hanging on his word like apostrophe And watch it come to pass like a prophecy When we come through your vicinity Flashing so right, you would think it's an emergency we're the sons of Jehovah When we come through we are the show for this power Steady and steady, steady, the blessing go they shower Anytime we rank is not a tag of the mola Children of God, yeah Shout hallelujah, yeah Shout hallelujah to the Lord Oh yeah, say me say children of God, yeah Shout hallelujah, yeah Shout hallelujah to the Lord Oh yeah, yeah, yeah Hallelujah, hallelujah, hallelujah to the Lord. Oh yeah, yeah, yeah. Hallelujah, 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 hallelujah to the Lord. Oh yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay, guys, so we're back and we had Snatcher, Children of God, the top track for Lady T for 2020. That's that's a banging track, I have to admit. It's actually a really good track, man. You did good there choosing that one. Listen, when you've got good speakers good uh, and like banging bass line on your speakers, whatever, trust me, turn that up. And even in your headphones, woo-wee, you just, you just get lost for three minutes. <laughs> You're you know in the world. I'm not even going to lie. I, I found it was a dangerous track for me because I had it on my playlist and I was listening to it while I was riding my motorbike on the road. <laughs> and I'm just like joking the, the bike forward like this while I'm going down the road. Absolutely crazy because <laughs> it's such a big track. But yeah, I actually do love that one. Definitely, definitely, man. It's jokes, trust me. Oh, it's brilliant. It's brilliant. All right, so what's your, what's your first track? And, the, and the, are they in any particular order as well? You know what? I'm, they're not in any. Actually, that's a lie. This first one's <laughs> gonna be my. <laughs> this first one's gonna be my top one for 2020 solely because it's the one I've probably listened to more than any other track, um, and this one is actually "Drip" by Sally featuring Bethel Olaje. Big track. Really? Yeah, I really love that track. Absolutely okay. loved it. So that is my number one track for 2020, man. I mean. I can't even begin to tell you how many times I've played this track everywhere. It's always on my list. So it had to be like my top 20, definitely. Wow, that is so interesting. And I do like Sally, actually. She's one of those um, new discoveries. 
that I had in uh, 2020. And I thought, this girl, she's, she's, she's pretty dope. She's pretty, pretty yeah, dope in the things that she does. And that particular track is actually really good. I mean, some people think that, is that really a, you know, a Christian song? I was like, yes, it is. Yeah, it's a, it's a, it's a Christian song, man. It's, it's, <laughs> and it's a dope <laughs> one too, so. <laughs> yeah. So, guys, listen, this is my one coming up right now. Sally um, Drip, trust me, banger. You're going to enjoy it. Here we go. So I did the UK first. I'm going to go to America. Okay. And it is Todd Delaney, Proverbs 3. Uh, write it on the tablet. Uh, write it on the tablet of your heart. This song for me, yeah, I'm just like... I, 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 even even up, up till today, like 2021, I am still listening to this track at least two, three, four, five times a week. Maybe even more than that. The, the, the lyrics talk about... And it's based off of Proverbs 3. Um... And um, there's a there's a there's an EP that he did, or was it an album? I can't remember which one it was. And he literally sang out of the Bible. So he had he sang some some songs of Psalms and then Proverbs as well. That's and so I, different, man. I've, I've never seen anybody do that. 
honestly, like he just literally just opened up a book and then he started doing it. And then from that, he released uh, some songs based off of reading those Psalms and those Proverbs. And this Proverbs was one, was one, Proverbs 3 was one of them. And it's such a banger. Like when you, when it starts, when, when the beat drops and then the drums, and then I was just like, oh, I love the yeah. drum pattern. In your element, and, yeah? <laughs> yeah, absolutely. <laughs> and it's so, so good. And it literally just talks about, you know, um, writing God's word on the tablet of your, on, on your heart, writing his words on your heart and continue to, um, live by his words and also not leaning on your own understanding as well so it's such a powerful track great um again great production uh, great lyrics everything about it absolutely banging so um so yeah love it it's just it's so good Definitely you know what w- would you would you i mean todd delaney i mean he's, he's been around for a little bit but would you um say he's like one of your top like american artists in terms of his music um He's definitely up there. I think so. Do you know what? I think so, yeah. He's, although he's big, he is a little bit underrated in certain elements. I don't know. I think so, yeah. Do you reckon? I I think he's a little bit underrated. Some people don't give him his credit sometimes. And for me, Todd is like, he brings it. He really, really understands the art of like, of worship and, you know, using the word to, to make music. And he does that perfectly absolutely perfectly so he's definitely definitely up there for sure for sure for sure without a doubt like he's brilliant i love it i love him cool well again introduce your track man all right guys so here it is this is todd delaney with proverbs 3 uh write it on the tablet of your heart all right so anyway my drummer came to me and said sing this scripture and then the scripture was Proverbs 3, and I just looked at it, and then I started going. Said we will write them on the day. Ooh, I see y'all be on Instagram, huh? Y'all be on. Said we really ought to write. Okay, let us sing the song, all right? Come on, let's go for it. Y'all gotta, we gotta find some energy. Come on. Huh? Write them on the He who abides in me will forever be fruitful indeed. I am the way, the truth, and the light. No one gets to the Father except that He comes through me. So let not my Say forsake you, forsake you. Say forsake you, forsake you. Let not mercy and we say forsake.
said, write it on the tablet of your heart. Let's get into the meat of my next one now. So, you know what? It's very hard for me to choose my top five. We already said that. It's absolutely crazy. And this particular one now is actually by um, Kofi, um, Just Like That. Absolutely love that track, Just Like That. The look on your face is telling me... Oh, wait, wait, wait. wait uh, you know what? I'm glad you're, you responded like that because the first look on your face made me think that, has she heard it? <laughs> Are we talking Kofi or coffee or which one? Are we doing Kofi? Oh, oh, listen, I don't know how it's pronounced. If it's coffee or co Kofi, I say Kofi. That's, that's it, how it looks to me. The K female artist, right? No, the male one. K oh, the male. Oh, yeah. <laughs> that one. <laughs> hey, it's a good thing that I thought it was the girl. I was like, Co coffee. I was like, dude. But no. anyways, that's okay. So Kofi, okay, this one yeah. I've not heard. I definitely oh, haven't heard okay, this Okay, so this is just like that. Um, absolutely big track. And the one I'm going to play, um, I'm going to... Well, I'm going to play the original version because mm -hmm. on YouTube, I'm going to, you know, want people to see the full video. But uh, the one that is my favorite is actually the remix version of it that he did with Call That Music. Um, absolutely big track. Yeah, that look in your face again tells me that you're thinking, Call That, I definitely haven't heard this one. <laughs> I, really, I really haven't. I literally haven't. <laughs> <laughs> well, yeah, it's, it's a big track. I mean, I heard it and instantly went to my playlist. Um, and for a long time, I was like, yeah, that was in my top five for 2020, just repeating it all the time. Big track. Um, I heard the original version first, and that was one I was repeating. And then suddenly I found out, what? He's got a remix with Called Out? I'll have some of that, because Called Out is just another guy that, once he's on the track, he just brings another element to it all together. So, yeah, that's that's going to be my one, I'll say, for the next one. Interesting. Okay, I need to check this one out. Yeah, Thank you know you. what? You definitely need to check it out. And you guys can listen to it now. I'm going to play it. This one is by... Kofi, I'm calling him, not Kofi. Um, just like that. Um, let's get it. <laughs> Let me just like that. Let me just like that. When I do you wrong. Let me just like that. Yeah. Let me just like that. Let me just like that. When I do you wrong. Let me just like that. SP did this. <laughs> Fire, 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 fire. I know go to tell you something we I never see before. I was lost and trapped when he came knocking on my door. You know the road is never easy. Couple people never love me. Even when I'm walking through the valley. But office grace never leave me, no, no. Baba God say he love me just like that. Love me, love me just like that. Even when I did you wrong, still they love me just like that. Yeah, love me just like that. Why you love me just like that? Even when I did you wrong, still they love me just like that. I've been so so bad to you, my lord. Do. Still I go do anything you say you want to. Said I'm not perfect, I think they know that. But to be like this, still I stand like so Na 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 Don't have every big father If it ain't so, then you better not go back No, no way, brother, please don't bother Tell the devil, man, that the best just for back Cause I know if they tell you something I don't see before I was lost and trapped when he came no Look, listen up. God so loved the world that he gave his best gift, Jesus. 
This was his presence to us. Jesus. Jesus. Baba God say he love me just like that. Love me, love me just like that. Even when I did you wrong. Still they love me just like that. Love me just like that. Why you love me just like that? Even when I do you wrong. When I do you wrong. You know the sheep them scatter. So if you get say better say my brother. Tell him say no be me Baba God pray. Holla. Say no be me Baba God pray. Plenty man just they pray for bless. Meanwhile they no getting nothing. Them days they chase the money. Searching for love in the wrongest places. Holla oh, Baba God we go love you just like that. Love you, love you just like that. Never ever do you wrong. Still they love you just like that. Yeah. Love you just like that Love you, love you just like that Never ever do you wrong Never do you So my next track for 2020, now this one wasn't really officially released at all and it's one of those ones where I call um, uh, album nuggets or EP nuggets um, and it's that track that's as well as the other songs but one particular song on the album stands out and it is by Called Out Music and um, it's taken from his uh, EP portraits that he did and that 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 EP itself is just yeah, it's a banging EP, man. I, mean, I don't on. even want to say. Yeah, <laughs> yeah. I don't even want to say. It is absolutely fantastic. Like from beginning to end, different styles, everything, and it's just it shows his versatility. Yeah, I think in terms does. of the styles that he can do, and also more production that he did as well, written everything but this particular track that i'm gonna play for you is called weights this track yeah yo if you've not heard weights off the portraits album by called out music what are you doing <laughs> <laughs> you know what? Honestly, how, how did you even manage to choose weight because that like you said the whole ep is just like absolutely banging i would have struggled to put or pull one out of there do you know what i don't know what it was i think i remember i was when it, when it got released i was listening to it i was lying down i was lying down listening to it and thank god i have good earphones so I was listening to it and I was listening to the album, everything like that. And when this one kicked in, do you know what it was? I think it was the the bass, the synth, the synth bass that uh, he used. Your bass girl, yeah. Listen, when that synth, when it kicked in, I was just like, I opened up my eyes, I was like, whoa, where the heck did that just come <laughs> from? Please. I'm like, wait a minute. Like, I was no. The synth bass, I was just like, oh my God, this is absolutely brilliant. And then as the song went on, and it got me emotional, to be honest with you, because it talks about, you know, when you have the whole, the, the weight of the world on your shoulder, um, you know, you need to, you got to remember to cast your burdens onto God. Like, yeah, so yeah. you'll have so many different types of weights, but cast it all onto God and he will make everything good for you because he tells us to cast our cares onto him and everything like that so at the time when I was listening to it I was just like and this is during pandemic and I was like God wow this song it was just speaking to me and it continuously speaks to me I'm like this is a jam like not only is, is it greatly produced arranged everything but also the lyrics on it is absolutely fantastic like again Turn this up loud if you're going to listen to it in your headphones or on speakers. It is an absolute banger. And honestly, I don't know what this guy can do wrong. Like, he just brings it every single time. I, I was going to say, I, don't, I mean, it's called out music. For me, he's one of the very few artists, when I hear that he's released something, I have no concerns about how it's going to sound. He's like, you just know, it's called out music. It's great. It's <laughs> simple as that. Honestly, honestly, but I do feel that's a little bit of a pressure though, because now now it's like every time you release something, it's like you got to be. You, it's, there's a small pressure to deliver every single time. Yeah, Sometimes yeah. you might not think that's delivering or not. And you can go back. Like I feel for I feel for him and artists that do that, like have that kind of feeling. But like it just shows that he's consistent 
and when he brings out it's quality stuff it's excellent so and you you you'll never doubt that at all so for me this track is absolutely the bomb and y'all need to go and listen to it so yeah so anyways this is called out music wait no, no, no. Oh, 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 oh. Dreams, so many dreams inside that you put inside of me. Mm. It gets hard to keep my head above the water. Yeah. When I feel the weight of the world on my shoulders, oh, I'll cast my burdens on you. I'll put my worries on you. When I feel the weight of the world on my shoulders. How it feels You know, you know, you know Just how it feels So many expectations Feeling the pressure on oh, no, the pressure. me Every day he gets stronger Every day it gets heavy Louder and louder I hear your voice calling out to me To cast all my burdens on you oh, When I feel the weight of the world on my shoulders oh, I'll cast my burdens on you I'll put my worries on you When I feel the weight of the world on my shoulders oh, I'll cast my burdens on Just how it feels leave you nor forsake you remember even though you go through rivers it, it will not drown you even though you go through fire it will not burn you hold on to the faith which the lord your god has put in your heart to follow and you will never remember the same in jesus name anyway i have made me some plantain for you so when you're ready go and have some God bless you. guys so we just had called that music and I, you know i need to say if i announce my my next track that i'm actually very surprised that i didn't have any of cool that's music on my top five for 2020 because i listened to a lot of his stuff really? uh, yeah it's really interesting come to think of it. i didn't have any of his tracks on there but i've listened to so much of his music um it, that's just going to show how tough it was just choosing those and honestly I really, yeah and I, I didn't want to be, be one of those things where i just had like the typical people that everyone expected. I thought, okay, I've got such a big, you know, array of artists that I listen to. So let's see what we could do with it. But yeah, called out. I'm very surprised he didn't make it on there at least. 
Okay, so you know what? That's that's actually like a a, a great song. But there's one thing about um for me for call out music for my top because you were talking about your um uh, your top five, and for me in my top ten for UK gospel uh for um Affinity Extra, I actually didn't put any called out music in my top 10. It was oh, one of my wow. favorite tracks, yeah. So he didn't feature in my fate in our top 10, but he featured on my other favorite tracks, Yeah, if that yeah, makes sense. Yeah. It's kind of crazy. I don't know why, but yeah. It, yeah, it just... that's kind of positive because that's your top 10 UK. Like, <laughs> that's like a guarantee for me. <laughs> I know, I know, but it just didn't work. It just didn't happen. I was like, and I'm, and I'm deep to it. I was like, ooh, should I? And yeah. I was like, oh, but yeah, you know, but either way, but anyways. He, he he appears in this one, so it, it, it's good. It's it's a it's an extra. What's the word? A compensation. Yeah, compensation. Yeah, definitely get that one. There in you there. go. There you go. Well, you know what? We're, for my next one, I'm going to be moving over to the US. Um, again, might surprise some, but my for my top five. This is one of my top five for 2020 that I was listening to, and it's actually 10K by KB. Uh, that is a banging track, in my opinion. Absolutely banging track. And you know, at first, I, he, he kind of threw me off because I listened to the track when he got sent over to me. And um, at first, I heard him singing. I'm thinking, where is he going with this? Why is he singing? No, dude, stay like, you know, in your lane, do your thing. And then the beat dropped. I'm like, oh, no, he didn't. He absolutely wrecked it. This track is a banger, no doubt. Dude, I absolutely agree with you. That's the same thing that <laughs> happened to me as well. Because when 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 we got sent it, I was just like, okay, ten. I was like, okay, few. I was like, okay, cool, 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 ten k. And then like, like you, he was singing. I was like, mm, what's going on here? And all of a sudden, the second that beat dropped, I was like, rah. Yeah. I was like, oh. <laughs> excuse me. I was like, okay. <laughs> yeah, yeah. I mean, this this track for me again, you know, similar to what you were saying earlier. It's like I love my music when I can hear the bass in my headphones and. I can't, in fact, I think I was probably sitting down and listening to music when I heard this one, and then he started singing, did a bass drop. I'm like, wait, 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 wait. Oh, rewind. Yeah, let, yeah, rewind that one and come back again so I can be prepared this time to give it the, the, the reaction it deserved. Um, absolutely banging track. I mean, I love all these things. I think the one of the first tracks that really caught my eye of him was um, No Chains. I mean, he's released a load of stuff before then, but No mm. Chains was the first one he did, which I thought, yeah, fire. But 10K, oh no, that just blows the lid of all the other tracks that he's done. Absolutely great track, that one. Definitely, man. Definitely. So, guys, you know what? You're going to get a chance to hear it now. Uh, this is KB with 10K. Enjoy. All right, so my next track, uh, I guess number four, you would call it, but again, it's not in no particular order, um, is Becca Folks with Rhythm. Yo, this song. <laughs> hmm. So she's released a couple of tracks um, in the year, which were great. But when this one got released, I was just like, ooh, where's this going? And then literally within the first 30... When when the beat dropped, I was I it, I, I was gone. I was just yeah, like, yeah. what? And then when it flowed, flowed, I was like, oh my days, this is serious. So um, yeah, and and I do like the style for her because you know she's you you've seen the kind of things that she's done yeah, in the yeah. past and everything. But then for her to do this kind of like Afro pop or Afro kind of like mix sound, I was like, go girl, this suits you. This absolutely suits you. And I think, and she worked with a, a Canadian pr uh, producer in, in Canada, I believe. And all my days, like, wow. Just the lyrics, the production, everything. Her voice, whoa, silky, 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 silky. You know what? I, I want to say, the one thing about Becca Fox is that Unlike a lot of um, artists that we see out there, she actually doesn't drop music as often as a lot of like the artists you might listen to and stuff like that. But mm. I think you're guaranteed that when she does drop the track, it's a banger. It's a straight banger. I mean, you might not hear from Becca for, for months <laughs> <laughs> on end. But when she <laughs> drops it, it's just like, ah, oh, you've done it again. We just got to add that straight in. Honestly, it's so true. Like you're absolutely spot on when you don't hear from her and then she brings out something you're like, Okay, this is worth the wait. Yeah, I get yeah, it. It's like yeah. I get it. This was yeah. worth the wait. So for me, yeah, Becca. This was this was actually number. I think it was number two in my top ten for um, UK gospel homegrown yeah, yeah. for 2020. So yeah, now nah, this 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 
she killed it. She killed it. But anyway, so here it is. This is Becca Folks with Rhythm. Help me find my rhythm, my rhythm, my rhythm. Help me find my rhythm, my rhythm, my rhythm. Voyaging by day and by night, searching aimlessly. Feels like I'm losing my mind. What could this be? Doing the life you live doesn't match what you know oh, oh, oh. Am I reaping everything that I've man my, my number four might surprise some because they might think okay you know there's bigger tracks out there but again this is my personal flavor <laughs> in terms of what i listen to for 2020 so my number four again like lady t said no particular order but it's the fourth one i'm sharing uh, is stevie valentine with plan for you um you know i actually love that track and you know I, I think i'm loving the tracks more nowadays where a lot of the artists are sharing the ones which are based on um, their partner or relationship or whatever else like that because you know we've had these debating groups lady t that we're saying that can <laughs> can people release music about their partners relationships and all this kind of stuff and i'm like yeah we can give it to us you know what i'm saying so we th- need that's more why. of it for me i think we need more of, i want to hear more of it like bring it please if you're an artist and you're watching this or you're listening wherever listen Bring out those love songs, okay? We want to hear it. I'm here for it 24-7. Bring it, bring it, bring it. Bring it. Anything yeah. about love, bring it. 
most definitely and stevie brought, definitely brought you with this one planned for you so guys i want to give it to you now you can check it out absolutely banging track stevie valentine plan for you let's go and girl, you're a blessing. I never want to see you stressing. Cause baby girl, you're a blessing. I got you my best friend. And don't you know you're a blessing? I never want to see you stressing. Queen, that's true. And God's got a plan for you. God's got a plan for you. You're yeah. queen, that's true. God's got a plan for you. Yeah, God's got a plan for you. Mm, baby girl, you're special. I never met nobody like you. I even told my brothers about you. I pray you be successful. I know this life can be stressful, but keep your head up. God has got you. No matter what you go through, you know that God will always come true. I'm blessed to have you in my life, girl. I'm grateful, my trophy. I show you off you're my trophy you know that christ is your safety granny never lazy i like your style girl you're wavy i like your style girl you're wavy baby girl you got this you a queen you're an average don't let nobody treat you average god is on your side oh baby girl live your best life i want to see you live your best life smart and your mind right yeah you're smart and your mind right live your life live it for christ and girl you're a blessing i never want to see you stressing because baby girl you're a blessing i got you you're my best friend and don't you know you're a blessing i never want to see you stressing queen that's true and god's got a plan for you god's got a plan for you yeah queen that's true god's got a plan for you yeah god's got a plan for you you know i spoil you like i'm supposed to and girl i trust you cause you're loyal i never stop praying for you free and you're gifted okay you never felt to impress don't be insecure girl you're flawless go together take risks god's got us so we got this i hold you down girl you know this pc always notice never lose your faith for your focus never lose your faith for your focus really came from nothing but maybe losing in an option and count your blessings not your problems this is a year of great things god is good so we praise him it's only christ that we're chasing and girl you're a blessing i never want to see you stressing because baby girl you're a blessing i got you my best friend and don't you know you're a blessing i never want to see you stressing queen that's true and god's got a plan for you god's got a plan for you yeah queen that's true god's got a plan for you yeah god's got a plan for you and girl you're a blessing i never want to see you stressing because baby girl you're a blessing i got you my best friend and don't you know you're a blessing i never want to see you stressing queen that's true and god's got a plan for you god's got a plan for you yeah queen that's true god's got a plan for you yeah god's got a plan for you all right so um for my final uh track final choice is one young man that really like 2020 was his breakout year honestly and he goes by the name of Kedron Bryant uh the track that I'm going to be choosing for you is you got this now a little backstory about Kedron he was actually um he actually appeared on a, on a, a competition singing competition on tv and I think he made the finals I can't remember if he won it or not but anyways came the pandemic came the George Floyd um, uprising, you know, when he was murdered and, you know, there was so much tension in the air. And then a, I think it was like 30 seconds or one, no, it was one minute. He sang a song that his mum wrote and it was, it was called, I Just Want to Live, God Protect Me, you know. Um, he's a young black man trying to do his own thing, but they're always coming out for it. It's, it you just need to go and listen to that song. When that song came out, it yeah. blew up just that 30 steps that one minute blew up but then it got the attention of a producer which has escaped me which is really annoying i try to remember it when we come back but anyway so this producer saw it did a remix of it the best remix out of everyone and it became a single and since then they've worked together and he has released like an ep and this song you got this was that track where i was like how old are you you are only what 13 yeah young man but real young Honestly, and then you get to sing on a song like this. Like this, 
this producer doing this beat and you got this young boy and I'm just like, it's like yeah. all these new working together so well. Like, and I love the song because of the sheer fact of the lyrics. I think for me, the lyrics in songs this in 2020 were standing out. And I think yeah. that's why I really picked the songs. These are really songs that the lyrics have stood out. So for me, this stood out because it was like, you got this, but you know that already. You got to keep saying to yourself, hey self, it's okay. You've got this. In 2020, you got this. 2021 and beyond, you have got this. So you know what? This I must say, you know, that, that guy's vocals, he and for, like I said, he's young. Yes. And he he's just like so on point. And you know, I, I would love to hear more music from him down the line, but I, I really hope that they've got a good team around him that is this current because he's so young. Do you know what I'm saying? He, and yeah, you don't need to fade out too, like too quick. So hopefully. He, I don't think he will because his mother is his manager and his parents are his manager. <laughs> so it's just like, hey, yeah, we. And I think, and I think they're getting the balance of it right. Yeah. And I've suddenly I've remembered the producer's name. His uh, the producer's name is called Dem Joints. Okay. Check him out. Brilliant producer. Like he he's he's crazy. Ah, oh, Dem Joints is is. If you need to know, go know about Dem Joints. He's a brilliant producer. He's done so much for so many artists as well. Um, but now doing this with Kidron has just been absolutely brilliant but um yeah trust me his parents are on it very much on it but anyway guys uh so this is my final track this is key drum bright with you got this all right guys so we're back and for me my last track and um, that's in my top five listening to for 2020 is by a hip-hop artist and you know again i think he's so underrated He's definitely my number one um, UK hip hop artist. You know what? There's a possibility he's probably my number one hip hop artist. Full stop. In terms of, and that's a, that's a very deep thing for me to say because I've got a lot of like uh, US hip hop artists which I really love. Um, I'm a hip hop guy, but Joe Joey, oh my days, yeah. I'll have some of that guy all day. He's just so rough and rugged with his music. Um, he's just real. What I call all right, real Joe Joey. What I call real hip hop. That's Joe Joey all day, all day. Wow. Um, it would have been a tough call between him and probably Melvilleus, but yeah, I, I got to give it to Joe, man. That guy, he he he's that dude for me. When it comes to hip hop, he's that dude for me. So Joe Joey, man, with these Black Queens, the message behind Black Queens, powerful. Um, again, I loved ones where they can step out of the boundaries and not talk about your typical kind of thing that you expect from artists. And the Black Queens track, um, no doubt it's going to be a very popular one with the ladies as well. But, um, <laughs> yeah, definitely, yeah. definitely a popular one with the ladies. And the, and the video to go with it, yeah, on point. So that's my top one. Yeah, the hip-hop, man. I'm telling you, Jojo, he's doing some some bits. I mean, from the back in the day when I used to watch him doing his freestyles, I, I okay. absolutely liked him. But yeah, gosh, I mean, so, you, you probably don't agree, right? I, I, no, no, no. Do you know what? And I think I've only heard of one of his songs, so I need to go back and read okay, it. But cool. I, 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 from what you're saying, okay, I feel like you're saying that Jojo is one to watch for 2021. Is that what you're saying in a way? He's been one to watch for a minute. For a long time? For a minute, trust me. <laughs> so, but, if you, but for people that haven't heard you and, you and you're liking your hip hop, yeah, check out Jojo. I mean, you can okay. go back to some of his freestyles. You can go back to, you can check out some of the other stuff he's done. He is that, he's that guy. Hip hop. He is that dude, most definitely. So, I mean, ask, what, what, what more do you want me to say? It's The guy's good. Do you know what I'm saying? The guy is good. So, guys, check it out right now. I'll give it to you, Joe Joey, Black Queens. Ladies, you're going to love it. Here we go. You only done it again, you know. Had to write a letter to my black queens Black face, black beauty and black dreams Me and you, tag team, that's a mad team And anytime you're in the room, you make a mad scene You came up from the bottom, you know how to hold it down They blame me for your blackness, cause you're funny and you're loud Black queen smile, you ain't gotta wear a frown Diamond for a heart, and all you're missing is a crown I'm telling you I mean it when I say this Baby girl, I love it when it's curly or it's braided It is never funny, cause you're going through some changes You ain't got a bleach out, and you don't need a facelift Cause baby girl, you're perfect Your skin glow like you're doing it on purpose and I hope that I can show you what your worth is mm, Worth more than your purses But you're beautiful, it's deeper than the surface Cause you're more than a triple threat Brains and the beauty and intellect You could be a go-getter and a chef Smell of your food got me hungry And I ain't even tasted your dinner yet 
What I'm saying is not a want, but it's a need. Black boy with a blade was running in the streets. I think about my mum, it could have been a mazzoline. Thank God I had a black queen praying on the knees. Black queen, you ain't got to do much to want to slay. Anytime you're going through the pain, you want to pray. I know you're heaven sent, you want to talk about faith. The way you walk with elegance, I know you're getting paid. It's expensive. Mm. Anything you need, man, I'm attentive. Mm. You're melanin strong like it's offensive. They're insecure, they see you when they get offended. They soon gone respect this, a letter to my black queens. And no one ever stutter. The black of the berry and there is not another no. Your skin's golden brown, you don't need the summer yeah. You shine bright, it's that cocoa butter See, I was in the gutter, got, got prayer for my mother, for my mm. mother. I can tell that everybody wanna be wanna you be I hope you. the world will get to see you how I see you These are words coming from a black brother This a letter to my black queen There we go Your mad flight and your swag clean How you step prestige And anywhere you go, man, you know that it's a mad scene Man, I had to write this letter to my black queen. But this is a letter to my black queen. Yeah. But your mad flight and your swag clean, how you step prestige. And anywhere you go, man, you know that it's a mad scene. Yeah. And man, I had to write this letter to my black queen. This a, this a letter to my black queen. Sure. You're beautiful. You are powerful, you are royalty, and you are God's gift. My black queens, don't let no one tell you different. Yeah, Joe Joey. Alright guys, so we're back again, and you know what? We had such a hard time choosing um, the tracks for our top five that we couldn't finish it without doing a special mention of other tracks which were also on our list so we're going to give it to you now just going to tell you what they are so you can go check them out for yourself so t what are your special tracks okay so my special tracks for uh 2020 were this and one of them was actually in 2019 i believe but i just couldn't start playing it so anyway so anthony brown and group therapy released a project called um stuck in the house pandemic project that album oh my god brilliant and there's a track called history on there that my friend alerted me to and that for me sealed the deal that track is absolute banger like oh again lyrics 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 i think for me from now on what well, always has been if the lyrics is not matching up with the track yeah i would probably dash it if the, yeah, the, the yeah. beat can be good the beat can be great, but the lyrics ain't working. Mm -hmm. I, I I don't want anything to do with it. And I've said this on an interview that I did uh, recently as well because I don't. But this worked. Yeah. And yeah. all the tracks that I've done this for the for the top roundup thing is because of the lyrics and the production has been on point as well. So I'm like, love it. Um, other ones were Bridge Music, Pour It Out. Woo! That's a, that's the tune. That's the tune. Yeah, I agree with you that know. one definitely, hundred percent. Oh, repeat, yeah. repeat. Yeah. Go check that yeah. out. And then you had um. An unlikely collaboration, unlikely collaboration with Lou Fellenham, Renzo B.A. Oh, yeah. And, uh, yeah, yep. And this How track... did I not put that in? See, there's too many tracks to put. There's too many tracks. Oh, my days. I'm telling you. I wanted to put that in my top five, but I was like, oh, my like this. Yeah, yes, yeah, yes. yeah. And it really would have been pure UK completely if I if I didn't put the other two tracks in it. So, anyway, Fix My Eyes, Lou Fellenham featuring Renzo B.A. And it was remixed by Ibe Giant Killer. Let me tell you, yeah, Ibe did a madness on this remix. Like, oh my God. Oh, it, my it was a giant God. killer remix, then you oh, know it's, it's all over. Yeah. Honestly, definitely. listen, guys, if you want a remix of a song, go to Ibe. He will get you a banger and you will love it. And it will hit to get them streams too. Yeah. See, see, Ibe, man, we give you that plug, man. Exactly. <laughs> <Both> <laughs> up, bro, trust me. The man, the man does some bits out Honestly, here. Honestly, so, yeah. and he's and he Ibe himself, he's actually got an album coming out this year. So look out for that. And I'm pretty sure that's going to be on top form as well. So I'm looking forward to that. And then um Dietrich Haddon. So he had an album called Time. Um and the song that I absolutely love is called I Appreciate. Or oh, actually, there's two open doors and open all season and I appreciate, but I appreciate it. Woo! That song, yeah? yeah. Oh, my Big day. Track. Big track. Literally just talking about appreciating God and all the things that he's done and continues to do. Like, even though sometimes it may be crazy and stupid, but I appreciate everything. Just the little, little things, man. So, yeah, those are those those are my special mention tracks. I could go on for so much more, but um, 
yeah, those are my. Oh, the Clark on. sisters. The Clark oh, sisters. Yeah, sorry. Yeah, yeah, the Clark yeah. sisters and uh, Snoop Dogg. Uh, his love. <laughs> on point. Yeah, Just love I mean, it. You may not be a Snoop Dogg fan, but seriously, on this track, whew, he bangs. Yeah, absolutely bangs. Straight fire, man. Straight fire. No, yeah. no doubt. You know what? It's what you said is so true. There's, there was for me, there was too many tracks for special mention that I had to actually stop myself. So I've only got two tracks that I've got to give a special mention to because I literally could have just sat down there and done it all day. There's just too many tracks. I think I shared um, on um, one of my um, platforms that Spotify said I listened to like 300 and something different artists last year. So it's absolutely nuts um, the amount of music that I went through. So my special mentions again, not a 2020 track, but 2019 it was. I killed it in 2020 though. Was the uh, Still Shady, Mark Jones, and Becca Folks track? Everything's changed. The remix, yeah, that is okay. a big track. I mean, some of you guys would have heard last week on my interview with Still Shady, and um, that we talked about this. That was one of my top tracks in terms of the remix. Um, and my other one um, is actually a reggae track by Samuel Midas. Um, I know you ain't heard this one, T. So because I don't, I know you're not big on the reggae. <laughs> So I know you ain't heard I'm it. Trying, I'm trying, I'm trying, I'm <laughs> trying. But there's a track that by Samuel Mead is called um, Can't Be The Only One. And I heard that track, I thought, oh my days, dude, <laughs> what are you doing to me, man? Yeah, that, that track, Bagger. that got rinsed, absolutely rinsed. I mean, yeah. I, I, I lost like battery power on my phone listening to this track. <laughs> <laughs> that's, that's how deep it is. Yeah, the, tr the track is a big one. So uh, Samuel Mead, we can't be the only one. That's my other mention. And I'm going to stop there because like I said, there's just we too many, too many tracks. Yeah. We can there's go too on. many tracks. Listen, people listening in, if you want to get a share from my playlist on Spotify, just holler at me. I'll send you that link because you'll see when I talk about there is too much music that could have made it onto the list. And it's absolutely yeah, fantastic music, especially, and like I said, UK, they did a job 2020. In fact, 2020, 2019, they've been doing some stuff, man. So Seriously, yeah. like I'm so, I, I think for the past, I'd say five or six years, maybe seven actually, like UK consistently, like yeah. the music, Literally. like, and I, and I think in the last two to three years has been the hardest to try and pick out your top tracks, yeah. like your top favorites and stuff like that, because there's been so many. And for me, that is what you call a fantastic problem. It is it a is, fantastic is. problem because it just means that what's been produced or what has been offered is a lot and it's just like it's hard to choose from because yeah. they're stepping up standards excellency mm -hmm. production everything i think more thought is going into what they are producing and also speaking as well so yeah it's fantastic absolutely fantastic. it is i mean one of the biggest problems um, us as like radio presenters djs have had for the longest time was the fact that we always talk well, back in the day we used to have to always source over from America and other places mm -hmm. but I can literally now just do shows and just pull UK eyes because there is just so much content out there right now it's amazing honestly yeah it's for me as well and I, I actually thought that I would struggle because um I do homegrown on Tuesdays on Affinity Extra and I thought I would struggle but like <laughs> there's some decent stuff coming yeah, in there is. on a weekly basis kind of thing so I'm just like okay okay keep it coming this is what I want keep you know some people that i've never heard of discovering as well and it's really really good so i'm just like yeah this 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 is the kind of thing we need this is the kind of thing i live for so it's a it's a privilege to be able to like bring and just expose new you know new artists in the uk and others doing who would continue doing it as well so yeah it's, it's fantastic come on uk come on definitely give a big round of applause for that one definitely man guys listen you've been tuned in with dj marks and lady t um on YouTube, just hit that subscribe button right down there. Follow the channel at DJ Marks UK. And on Instagram, you can find me as well. Same thing, DJ Marks UK. T, what channel can they find you on and on social? Okay, so you can find me uh, Tuesdays on Affinity Extra, 5 p.m. Playing all things UK gospel. And then also Saturday mornings at 8 a.m. Uh, social media, uh, at Lady Tolu on Instagram and on Twitter. Twitter and Facebook.com forward slash uh, Lady T Presents. And then YouTube. Okay. I'm officially on YouTube as well. So YouTube, check out my YouTube channel. Subscribe because we want some more. We've got great stuff. Uh, YouTube is uh, Lady T Official on YouTube. Just look for Lady T Official on YouTube and then boom. Great. So guys, thank you so much for watching in. 
Um, it's been a privilege. And like Lady T says, subscribe and follow her. Same thing here, DJ March UK. Catch me on Clockwork Show of Finty Extra 9 p.m. on Wednesdays. Fridays repeat at 1 p.m. And yeah, I think that's it for us, right? Yes, indeed, indeed. Thank you so much for having me. It is being an absolute pleasure and yeah, so it's much been, it's been great this. having you here man definitely we had some fun so it's all good so guys <laughs> signing out dj marks later <laughs>